Talk, talk to me. WSRadio.com Welcome to Performance in Motion with your host, Dr. Dennis. Okay, folks, we're back. We're in our third segment with Mr. Justin Roth. Welcome back. Folks, are you ready? Here we go. We're going to get into what Justin likes most about coaching. You're on. You know, there's a lot of things to, to really enjoy about coaching. Um, just working with people. I love working with my kids. I work with kids ranging from three to, I think my oldest student's like 65. So <laughs> that's a huge range. It is a really big range, but you get a lot of different experiences. Sometimes the most interesting things are said by kids. So you're always learning, you're always adapting and it just keeps you motivated. You know, you're Every time you work with someone new, it's something fresh. It's something interesting. You never know what's going to happen the next time you come in. And just being able to share information and help people grow, there's nothing more exciting than to see your student achieve success, something that they've been working on. There's just something so satisfying to see them so excited. You know, I... To a point, I wish we had video here to see Justin's face <laughs> because he has just lit up just like, uh, I guess, you know, what, what we just saw Christmas, you know, with that star, you know, with, with um, Jesus being born. I mean, I just saw a visual right now. <laughs> and, and, you know, the authenticity, again, the passion and the joy that's truly exuding from him right now um, is mind-blowing. And uh, in the future... Uh, we're going to do some videos, and you're going to see that this young man is real, as real gets. And uh, I wanted to ask you a few things, Justin, more detail okay. um, about your, your specialties, because there's a lot of figure skating coaches out there. Yes. So what do you do differently, and what, do you, what are your specialties? So two of the things that I really focus on is I work on jump technique. So I work with a fishing pole harness and really try to help those kids overcome the fear of certain jumps, specifically the axle. The axle is a rotationary jump that's one and a half rotations. You take off wow. forward and you land backwards. And it's a big step up from all the jumps that you've done previously. So a lot of coaches bring me in to help their kids overcome that jump. I get them a little bit of height, a little bit of stability, so that when they're going for the jump, they're starting to learn it, they are more comfortable so that they're willing to give more into it. The other thing that I really specialize in is I do ice stance, and I can both partner or just teach it. So that gives me kind of a niche. There's only a couple of us in San Diego who can partner in the ice dances, and I sure. have completed the whole regimen of ice dance from the preliminary dances to the gold, and I've now started delving into the international dances because there's even less of a pool of people who know those, and they're actually a lot of fun for me to do, but it also, the more, again, the more knowledge that I take in, the more I'm able to pass out. Incredible. Um, just want to go back to when we first talked about, uh, you mentioned the uh, fishing pole harness, which I mm -hmm. didn't know what that was originally. Can you, can you let our listeners know what that is? Yeah, so uh, we have two different types of harnesses. You know, the normal pulley harness, you strap on kind of like a backpack sort of thing, okay. and you help lifting the kids with a pulley harness. Gotcha. But it's so binary. You can only be in one space. So anything okay. that requires more edge work is really difficult. So the fishing pole harness takes that same sort of rod that you get off a fishing pole, right. attaches a harness onto that, and then you strap the kid into that, and you're able to follow them on any sort of pattern that they need to go on for their jumps. Very cool. So I can't help as much as a pulley harness, but I do, I'm able to help them feel it like it would be in a program or in their actual training environment. Very cool. So one of the things that you do is you're basically collaborating with other coaches and you're the specialist coming in for the jumps. Yes. 
And then the second component is the dance. Correct. Yep. Wow. So that really exposes you to quite a few coaches out there. It does. I have to make sure that I keep working with all these coaches because um, it is so specialized. I mean, I do work. I love teaching tops. I love teaching kids and I love lear- doing the learn to skate. And that is something that I enjoy doing. But the specialties, they're so specialized that I do have to work with all the coaches, but that's awesome. I love it. There's something so, uh, it just feels really good to work with people and to learn from them. Again, they all have their own set of experiences. So when I'm working together with these coaches, they might teach with a different style than I would. So I try to absorb that. And if something that I've done doesn't work for my kids, I can bring other coaches' influences in, so that makes me more well-rounded. So that's a win-win situation for both you and the coaches, and you're actually getting paid to learn. Exactly. That's that's a pretty good deal. I agree. <laughs> and then on top of that, you know, you're you're truly seeing the efforts of your labor and really customizing your approach for each kid. Yeah, exactly. Every kid is different. And so you have to approach every student differently. Wow. Um, Do you ever use, uh, and I'm sure the answer is going to be yes, but I'm going to ask you anyway, uh, utilizing video to analyze what what a student may need? Definitely. Video analysis is so important. I always try to make sure to video different stages of a jump. So – of both of the kids doing it so that they can see what I'm talking about, but also of professionals doing it so that they can see side by side what we're looking for. Absolutely. You know, I I, I share this concept and this practice with many amateurs out there, and sometimes they look at me like I have five heads or I'm speaking another (laughs) language. And you know what's funny is, um, correct me if I'm wrong, but we all have video pretty much on our phones, right? Yeah. There's apps. You can just use a normal camera app. You can slow down frame by frame. I love, there's an app that I use where you can slow it down to like an eighth of the speed so that you can see almost frame by frame so that the kid can see exactly what they're doing. Very cool. And so that constant review, observation, and then verbally sort of as a hypothetical you know, you have little Johnny or little Mary and say, okay, you're doing A, B, and C well. We need to work on D. Mm-hmm. Exactly. And we can, I can show them that. And that's what's so important about video because I can say whatever I want. I can say, oh, you're letting your right arm open. But if they can't feel that, they can't see it, then there's only so much they can do. But when you show them a video, you're like, do you see it step such and such that you're allowing that right shoulder, that left shoulder to open up. And I really need you to keep it in front. Once they see it, a lot of the time it clicks. Absolutely. And uh, again, I'm putting on my science nerd hat (laughs) on. And, you know, again, we, we almost practice the same way where movement analysis, functional movement, sports specific movement, and analyzing that so you have a baseline. Mm -hmm. And then it's continuous reviewing to fine tune. Exactly. There's no perfect, right? Every person is different, but there is a base standard that we're looking for. If you're going into a jump, if you allow your right side to open up, you're going to flip out of it. So you've got to understand where your shoulders, where your hips, knees, where your body is aligned. And if you don't understand alignment and how it works in skating, then it's going to be a mess. Absolutely. You know, the things, the concepts, the style, the -hmm. practices that that Justin is sharing with us is 100% on target. It is backed by research. And, and I'm not sure if you heard this, Justin, but video is one of the highest forms of learning out there. And the reason is, is everything you said. We learn by seeing as humans for the most part. And when you mentioned earlier, there are components of the verbal, the audio that you had mentioned, and there were variances in that. 
But for the most part, for us humans to learn, we need both. Mm -hmm. Definitely. I know I went to a seminar and they really talked about this and how so many coaches want to just say it, but you can only get so much from when you hear it. So showing them with video and a lot of the times skating is a very physical teaching. So they need to feel it. So a lot of the times I will put them into the positions that they feel. I'm like, okay, I need you to feel this. And then we'll video it so that they can see and connect the feeling with the visual because saying can only do so much. So I tried to really combine all three so that my kids can feel, see, and hear what they need to do. Wow. Ladies and gentlemen, did you hear that? (laughs) Feel, see, and hear. All the coaches out there, all the parents out there, that's the standard. That is the pro standard for long-lasting results. I can't believe this, Justin. This is the third segment, and it's almost done. Where's I know. I, saw, time going? <laughs> I have no idea. That went fast. Okay. Well, we're going to get into – we're at the end of this segment, and uh, we're going to get into for the last one, which is making me sad, but we'll have you back here. What motivates and inspires you, and what has your experience been with uh, our interaction when you had uh, a back injury? So, uh, folks, stick – Stay tuned for the next segment. And this is Dr. Dennis, and you're listening to WSRadio.com, the worldwide leader in Internet radio. This is Rob Barnett, CEO and founder of VinVillage.com and the Wine and Dine Show on VinVillage Radio. Do you have a wine, event, product, or service to promote? Then contact VinVillage.com to reach thousands of wine lovers across the country. VinVillage connects like-minded wine enthusiasts with unique and exclusive wines, events, products, and services. To learn more, contact us on VinVillage.com. VinVillage is where wine lovers connect. Life is full of misadventures, from car crashes to home fires to getting choked out on the mat. Yes, I said getting choked out because I'm Carlos Kramer, jiu-jitsu competitor, MMA and media personality, and mild-mannered insurance agent. You can follow my adventures on Kick-Ass Radio, and I can protect you from life's misadventures at Kramer Insurance. Home, auto, life, business, and workers' comp, we're at KramerINS.com, and I want you to join my world. You've heard me bragging about Progressive Medical Center and how they've helped me feel so much healthier. But one thing, Dr. Agoli, that a lot of people come to you with is just unexplained pain. They just can't get any relief. Why can Progressive Medical Center's Pain Management Center help them? First of all, we have to acknowledge that pain is for real and you've got acute pain and chronic pain. Here's the problem. That acute pain turns to chronic, which is longstanding, and no one's getting to the root cause. There's several key diagnostic components that help us get to the root of what's causing this pain. Is it inflammation? Once we do a thorough evaluation to get the root cause determine if it's structural or if it's a metabolic issue. And this way, we put an individualized program for pain management involving correcting the spine, using certain injections when necessary, and we get our patients out of pain quicker, and they stay out of pain because we teach them how to live their life well. Don't let yourself live in pain any longer. Get a hold of Progressive Medical Center today at ProgressiveMedicalCenter.com. Progressive Medical, this is your life. Live it well. Nowadays, Internet devices are an integral part of your home. Everyone in your family has a smartphone, tablet, or a computer. Life is easier knowing that all your devices are secured and your family can surf the Internet carefree. ESET Multi-Device Security Pack does just that. One license for all your devices. With ESET, it's simple to stay protected and save money. Enjoy safer technology with ESET Multi-Device Security Pack at ESET.com. That's E-S-E-T dot com. You take your smartphone almost everywhere you go. Now WSRadio.com can be there, too. Search WS Radio in the Play Store for your Android devices or iTunes for Apple and download the WS Radio application. WSRadio.com, on your phone and in your ear everywhere you go. Download the WS Radio application. Do it now. 
It's very easy. WSRadio.com.